Today we're going to talk about how to install Adobe Lightroom presets. This is going to be a short video, so let's do this. Hey guys, this is Justin and welcome to my channel where it's all about photos, videos and camera stuff for beginners. So start right now by clicking subscribe and the bell button beside to get notified every time I post a video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram as well if you want to learn more about camera settings because I post my settings alongside my photos every single day. I've recently launched my Cyberpunk Lightroom presets and profiles on my website, so check them out. I'll link them down in the description. Lightroom CC and Lightroom Classic are both very, very powerful software that complements your photos. They both provide users with tons of adjustment options to the photos that you have just taken. But they can be tricky and intimidating if you're just starting out. If you haven't watched my previous video about how to use Adobe Lightroom as a beginner, then I suggest you to go watch that first before coming back to this. I'll link everything on top of the corner right here or down in the description. One of the easiest ways to use Adobe Lightroom is by using presets or profiles. They serve as a guide or a start or like a shortcut for you in achieving the look that you really want. So now let's talk about how to install them. Start by clicking the develop module on the top right corner area and under the preset column, just click the plus icon and then import presets. After selecting your presets in your safe location, you will see the presets shown in the presets panel. Just click on them to start using them. If the presets don't work on your photos, then don't worry. Just tweak them around a bit and I'm pretty sure they'll work. Feel free to play around with them because no preset or should I say no one preset fits all. Just remember you can always reset by clicking the slider thingy. I still haven't figured out what is it called. And once you have tweaked them, you can always update your presets with the current settings. Before we continue, can you tell me by commenting down below on what kind of tutorial would you like to see next? Help me to create better content for you, okay? Now that we're all done about installing presets, let's talk about how to install profiles instead. First, click on develop module on the top right corner and then click the four little boxes icon in the basics panel. Next, just click on the plus icon on the left corner of basic panel and then click import profiles. Profiles are really different from presets because of the information that they hold. Upon applying profiles, make sure that there's no presets applied on them first. If not, just click reset on the bottom right corner for them to work properly. Unlike presets, profiles do come with opacity slider that allows you to control the strength of the colors. So that's all for importing presets and profiles into Adobe Lightroom CC or Adobe Lightroom Classic. Make sure that you organize your profiles and your presets properly and organizedly in your desktop before importing them so that you don't get confused later on. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well as clicking the bell button beside to receive updates on my next tutorial. If you want a more detailed guide with step-by-step -step pictures on these videos, then there's actually a written article on my website. I'll link everything in the description. Go check them out. Like if you like this video and thank you very much for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.